Hey everyone, Jody from Bear Dog Off-Road Adventures here. Today, we're going to do a quick install of the new Animaka hammock. Stay tuned. All right, guys, it's a little windy out here, so sorry if there's any noise. I'll try my best with the mic. Hopefully, it'll help out. Before warning, first disclosure, I've never put this thing up before, so this is my first time. So you're seeing it live. I got the dogs here with me. I don't know if you can see them. They're kind of hanging out, enjoying the scenery as well. Uh, we're actually out here outside of uh, beautiful Sedona, Arizona. Highly recommend you come check this place out if you get the chance. So first, we got to unbox it. Now there may be some wrapping stuff in there that you wouldn't have if you've used it before. We're gonna find out. So we'll get this thing unzipped before we actually assemble it, because there is some packaging still in here, just FYI. Here's the actual hammock. Uh, here's the canopy. We might try to put that on here in a little bit. And cup holder. I was very happy to see that we got this. So this will be very handy. All right, so there is some foam in here. I'm going to have to be careful, make sure I don't uh, get any out of the, don't definitely don't want to litter. Make sure the foam stays in the bag. Of course, we'll get rid of that when we get home. And it just says here, basically, you just pull these levers out, it looks like. So, I'm going to step in front of the bag, or actually step back some. Now I have to make sure I catch this. There is a strap down here you have to undo. Keep in mind, they say three seconds. It's not going to take, I'm not going to be able to do it my first time. So just bear with me. There we go. Wow. There you go. With the two clicks, you're done. Now the hammock that comes with the kit. Like some other hammocks, you just, it's part of the back. There you go. Like I said, my first time opening it, bear with me. I am going, it's, it's, this is a learning curve for me. And I'll be honest with you, I'm not a hammock guru. Hadn't done a lot of them. All right, you just take these two hooks off. And based on what I've seen other people do, you basically put this through the end here. Put your little uh, thing down here where it hooks as soon as I find it here oh there it is so you hook it in the end there same for the other side and we're going to adjust this so it is adjustable so just know that you're not stuck with a one size fits all deal There we go. All right, so this is lowest setting, looks like, which obviously we don't want. There we go. At least not for the initial setup. Awesome, awesome. Ah, so here we go. So you can pull this a little bit. That's pretty cool. Like I said, this is going to look very sloppy because I've not done this before. So bear with me. Also, remove before use. And then this, you'll notice here, it pulls the hammock down. So, ah, there we go. Now, I'm a big guy. So this thing has a 550 pound weight limit. We're going to check out this Sedona Desert here. Uh, or Saran, Sanarian Desert, I should say. Wild in a hammock. I can't think of a better place. But, by no stretch of the imagination. First time using it, so bear with me. Give me to reposition this thing. Because guess what? We got a beautiful view here we want to take advantage of. So, I said Sedona. Is down there, and we're up here. Uh, pull my hat down, keep the sun on my eyes, and check out beautiful Sedona. Beautiful view. I will be using this. This is probably one of the better items I have from as far as overland slash camping. Uh, you know, like I said, it's my first time using it. 
been a long time since I used any hammock. So this will definitely be uh, something I value for a long time to come. Show you this little uh drink holder here it also has a thing for your phone and if you have keys you can hook your keys right here now you do want to go up high as you can because otherwise this won't be vertical and i don't know if you'd want to use a cup without a lid because you're probably going to drop it depending if you're laying down now if you're sitting up in the chair mode probably not so much well, with the wind being so high on the mountain, we came back home and put the canopy on. So, show you guys what it looked like. I don't know if we'll be using this that much because we have an awning on the truck, but figured some of you all might want to be curious about how it looks. So, we wanted to show you. All right, now to put this thing back up, it's pretty quick and simple. All you got to do, bring this knob all the way down. Same over here. Takes you like a couple of seconds, maybe. And then one handed. That's it. Put the strap around the bottom, toss it in the bag, you're ready to go. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoy this. Please hit that like and subscribe button. We'll put a link to this thing in the description below so you can get your own. Take it easy.